This segment of Delmarva Life is brought to you by Coastal Hospice and Palliative Care. We've seen it time and time again. Great things happen when communities come together. And that is the idea that our next guests have and our country's greatest heroes are the ones who are going to benefit from it. We'd like to introduce to you this afternoon Coastal Hospice's Access Manager. Uh, this is Nancy Stewart and Chairman of the Board, Mr. Steve Farrell. Thank you so much for joining us this afternoon. Thank you for having me. Mr. Thank Farrell, uh, 31 years in the Navy, retired as commander. 21 years 21, in the Navy. 21, 21, 21 years, years in the Navy. Thank you for your service. Well, thank you. I enjoyed it. it and thank an you for coming in to talk to us about this today because it's a really important thing. You've got an event coming up and you're really wanting to benefit our veterans. Absolutely. What are you doing? Well, this is an event that's being held for Welcome Home Vietnam Veterans, and we are holding this event so that we can commemorate the men and women that sacrificed so much during the Vietnam War, um, and also finally give them a proper welcome home, the one that they didn't get when they came home over 40 years ago. Yeah, and it's important to have this type of support for veterans, right? Very much so, and I would just echo what, uh, what Nancy said about honoring the, the veterans of Vietnam because there was not a lot of thank you for your service in that day when, when veterans came home. That was a, a tough period yeah. to be in the military. So we think it's very important to, to show the support for the veterans of that area. Yeah. Do, you, do you see a lot of veterans come through coastal hospice? We do, yeah. we do. Roughly 20% of our hospice patients are veterans. And of that 20%, we have a honor our veterans program that Nancy has instituted at, at Coastal Hospice. And we do visits with about 80% of the veterans who are hospice patients. Wow. So considering how they weren't welcomed home, do they reminisce a lot? Do they have stories to tell? They do. They do. It's, it's remarkable to visit with a veteran in what are realistically the, the last months of their lives. And one thing that comes across very clearly when you visit with them is how much they valued their, their service in the military mm -hmm. and how much they appreciate being recognized for it. It's really a, a great, great feeling to, to visit with them. Wow. How did Coastal Hospice get involved with the event? This was an event that was um, started by the three hospices that serve Maryland's Eastern Shore. Um, from the, the eight counties that are on the shore. And uh, it's Coastal Hospice, Talbot Hospice, and, <clears throat> excuse me, Company, Compass Regional Hospice. So the three of us got together in order to be able to offer an event um, in that magnitude for the Eastern Shore. So, so what, can, what can we expect <clears throat> if we come? The event will, it's, it's really going to be quite an event. We will have resources there for our veterans. And I do want to say, even though this is a Welcome Home Vietnam Veterans event, we are there and to invite and honor all veterans. So any veteran can, can attend, and we, we will welcome them to do that. Um, but this is an event that will have resources available for our veterans. We will have uh, guest speakers. We'll have um, special patriotic music. We're going to have bagpipes. There's going to be a pinning ceremony for our Vietnam veterans, oh as well as some refreshments afterwards. But it really, really uh, hopes to be a fabulous and very moving event. I do want to say that we, every hospice involved, will each have a grief counselor on staff um, at the event because we really feel like we may invoke some emotions that day yeah. because mm -hmm. it really will be something special. Wow. So you're looking for Vietnam veterans and then other veterans as well, right? Right. The Vietnam veterans will be formally recognized and celebrated at the event, but any veteran, any and all veterans are welcome to attend the event. All right, so give me real quick the where's and the when's. Okay, the where's. The where's are um, Easton High School, uh, March the 30th, it's a Saturday, March the 30th from 1 to 3 at Easton High School in Easton. And um, if you are interested in um, attending, there will be a phone number available and also um, an Eventbrite website that, that will be available for uh, registration. It is a free event to all those who attend, um, and that's the that's, wins and wears. That's the wins and wears. <laughs> Nancy Stewart with Coastal Thank you Hospice. so much. Commander Farrell, thank you so much for your service and thank, thank you, you for, for having us today. Wonderful having you.